Hello Cancer, my darlings, and welcome back to my channel, Luma Moon Tarot. So Cancer, it's super, super early in the morning, right? Um, I'm trying to be as quiet as I can, but you know, that probably isn't going to happen. Anyway, Cancer, just take what resonates, leave the rest behind, okay? And thank you so much, everyone, for all of your support. I love you guys. Um, thank you to all of my subscribers. Everybody new here, hi, welcome. All right, so Cancer, your oracle cards, um, they pretty much explain everything. There's a masculine, I feel, who wants your forgiveness, okay? All they're doing is watching you, admiring what you're doing. The song that I'm getting for your reading is the theme, uh, the theme song from Mary Tyler Moore, who can turn the world on with her smile, right? I feel like um, this person watches you maybe on the internet. Um, I feel like you've got some kind of platform or you're uh, maybe on social media, that kind of thing. But every day this person watches you, okay? And they admire you. They see how much you've transformed. They're seeing your light. They're seeing you maybe do some miraculous things out here with your life, okay? And they're realizing that um, ever since they let you go, ever since they walked away from you and deceived you, um, they've had nothing but bad things happening in their life, okay? It looks kind of like total and utter destruction. This is like a tower moment, but I feel like everything has just been falling apart in this person's life without you. Um, and now they want, yeah, look at, now they want your forgiveness, Cancer. This person's all up in their head. They can't eat. They can't sleep. They're having nightmares. Um, thinking about you, you're the only one that they want. You know, they just want your forgiveness. You're a light in this person's life and you're moving on, um, with your chariot. You're moving on without this person. They've put you through a battle. And uh, you're coming out victorious, okay? Some of you could even be moving to a new location, maybe. This is forward movement. So you're moving on uh, without them, all right? And they're watching you, um, everything that you do. See, I feel like you're, they're watching you on the Internet. So this is like cyber stalking, okay? Um, and they're realizing you were their, you were their wish fulfillment. Um, Ten of Cups. Yeah, they could be watching you um, make some kind of house move, Cancer. Or if you've moved recently, this person is like trying to dig up information, maybe find your address. They're really trying to keep good, uh, like close track of you, Cancer. But um, I've, I'm getting that you may be keeping your personal information hidden. Because this person's on the internet long hours every day watching you and trying to get as much information as they can. They could be seeing you out here living wish fulfillment without them while their life is kind of getting all kinds of screwed up. Like, I just feel like anything that they had going on is being destroyed. They could be losing their money, their finances. Things could be happening to their home. Um, I feel like if they were in a home situation with someone else, that's coming to an end. It feels like a lot of destruction in their life ever since, ever since they dogged you out, ever since they wronged you. Yep, see, you're their wish. They want to go where you're going, Cancer, but now this person's feeling stuck uh, because of how they treated you in the past. Yeah, see, and you, they see you as being their happiness now, okay? So this person deceived you, could have possibly put you in a third party. Now they want to get back together. Look at this cancer. They want this love, and they can't take it anymore. Yeah, you're everything. You're the Ten of Cups. You're the, I'm uh, sorry, the Ten of Cups, the Ten of Pentacles, the Ace of Cups, and the Sun to this person. You're like everything to them. If they had stayed with you and put their effort into your connection, if they had believed in you, 
if they didn't wrong you, they could have had ultimate wish fulfillment. This is the kind of life that everyone dreams of having. Okay, and they blew it. They know that. When they deceived you, they actually deceived themselves. This person is now being taught a lesson. There's that tower moment. And I feel like they're also being led to come in and apologize and give you your justice. Spirit demands justice for an earth angel. Okay? That's what this is. And I feel like Spirit is saying we're going to keep giving you a tower moment every day until you apologize and bring in this, this earth angel's justice. Yeah, for breaking your heart and possibly putting you in a third party and betraying you. This person's getting punished until they come in and do the right thing. Okay, for real. Yeah, taking action. Okay, towards the world. This is, once again, being everything. I feel like, Cancer, you've done all that spirits asked you to do. Um you've closed out a cycle with flying colors you've done you've done it beautifully all right now you're balanced you're um you're healing or you've healed you've got all of these options around you money coming into all this wheat that's opportunities and money okay i feel like you are um in the public eye here with the world card you're also closing out a cycle and moving forward with the world and the chariot. Um, and you're having this victory being put up on a pedestal by the divine because they've seen everything that you've been through and they've seen all that you've accomplished here and all the effort you put in. Um, I feel like the 5D is just proud of you. Your spirit, your spirit team, your ancestors. I feel like the universe wants you to have a win here, Cancer. And I feel like they're telling this person it is time. With the world card and the eight of wands and justice, it's time to bring you your justice. I'm t if this person, every day that they continue to hold back an apology, um, they get a tower moment like every day. Okay? That's their punishment for what they've done to an earth angel. So yeah, this person is being, it's almost like they feel compelled to come forward and talk to you, Cancer. Page of Pentacles. Um, this could very well be your twin flame. I've got the Lover's card on the bottom of the deck. Yeah. There's been no communication. You may have already made a decision um, to move on without an apology right? Not speaking to this person. Um, yeah, you may see them as a manipulator, somebody who's just going to betray you, Cancer. So this person is being led forward to come and apologize. Um, you may not even want to hear the apology anymore, honestly. After, uh, you know, after what they've done to you, and how long it took them to come back in. Um, it could have been up to eight months, eight years for some of you. You know that you've been waiting for an apology. Yeah, see, this person, they had the Ace of Cups right in front of them. The Holy Grail Cup of Love. You were an absolute blessing for this person in Earth Angel Energy. And they turned their nose up at you. You know, I feel like th there's been so much disrespect, um, not done to you, but on your name. And spirit wants, they want this person to come in and bring you justice. I kind of feel like they're sort of kicking them in the butt the whole way. Okay. Um, yeah, definite look. And they're under judgment, right? Yeah, they're under judgment. You're out here in a time of your life right now, Cancer, where you're just celebrating. It feels like a celebration time. Um, this could be like, you know, having the Christmas, like, you know, um, the Christmas spirit, right? Celebrating Christmas parties, going out with your friends, that kind of thing. You could be spending a lot of time 
just having a good time, Cancer, but you've worked for this. Um, I feel like you're about to also see a lot of money come in, something that you've nurtured, worked on. I, I feel like it's about to pay off. All the seeds you planted in the past, they're about to pay off. If you haven't seen this money come in yet, it will. All right? It's going to be a time of celebration for you. Because if you're not getting your justice from heartache, I feel like spirit is bringing you in your blessings now. Because you deserve to be happy. And the universe wants you to win. Um, so, yeah, I feel like... Um, this is uh, with judgment out here and the ace of pentacles and the lovers i feel like spirits telling this person this is the time when you need to come in and make something right okay i'm also getting that you could be making a judgment call in this cancer um and you know closing out a cycle with this past person you've got new opportunities new options in love that are coming in for you i feel like whoever is noticing you in the background cancer because i know you've got people like coming out of the woodwork that are going to want to date you that are going to want to court you um you're a turn on for everybody okay you're out here happy celebrating working you're independent you're abundant you're absolutely stunningly beautiful here with the earth angel and the nine of pentacles that's that's stunningly beautiful and everybody wants you everybody wants a person like you okay <laughs> you're literally everything here wish fulfillment for anybody and i feel like everybody is noticing you um you're attracting a lot of attention to yourself in the energy that you're in. And it's a turn on. It's your independence, your strength, your perseverance, the way you work, whatever you're building, your glow, because you're literally glowing out here. Okay? It's turning heads and turning people on. Okay? Just so you know. Um... So I feel like your person is being called now to do the right thing. It's time. It's like time for them to bring you your justice. And if every day that goes by that they don't, they, they continue to be punished by the divine. This is, it feels like more of a punishment on a daily basis. Okay, so this person is compelled to come in and ask for your forgiveness. Yeah, so here they come, Cancer. It's been a long time coming, but this masculine Knight of Pentacles energy, they're coming in. They're feeling very guarded, okay, um, because they don't know what you're going to say after all of this time and after everything that they've done. But they know they need to come in and make it right, okay? All right, so what else can you show me for cancer? I don't think spirit's going to leave them alone. Um, I, I feel like every day they're getting this message, go in and give cancer her justice, or you're going to be sorry. That's what that is. Go and give cancer this justice, or you're going to be sorry. This person's already in a lot of regret. Um, for everything they've done to you, the fact that they let you go and now you're like you're like a wanted person okay <laughs> um for real everybody seems to be wanting a chance with you here cancer yeah and here comes somebody new i feel like this is new love coming in yeah they're gonna be real sorry they're they're missing their shot here but Honestly, Cancer, with the Two of Swords out, you may have already made your decision. I feel like you're in this Queen of Wands energy right now. Look at the sexiest queen in the deck. Everybody wants you, Cancer, okay? Um, you're a turn on for everyone. And here, the, these new people are going to start rolling in. And I feel like you're going to end up having a new beginning with someone else. And this person is going to lose their opportunity and they're going to have to face punishment for what they've done to you. 
So just know this, Cancer, this person is being called to come forward. And they are, but they may be coming in a bit too slow because you're about to get new love, new people entering in your life. You're about to be going out on dates. I'm not kidding, man. There's a lot of people who are on fire for you, okay? Like very passionate for you. And this is when they start coming in to ask you out. So get ready for that, all right? And this person is being punished on a daily basis. Like the punishment, I, I don't even want to call it karma anymore. Um, I want to call it a punishment because it's like every day that goes by, spirit is kicking them in the pants to come in and bring justice to an earth angel. Like they're demanding this. Okay. Ooh, Cancer. Let's see what um, what this person is feeling. Mixed emotions deck, right? How are they feeling about the situation? Feel like they're having a hard time. They know they don't have any time left. Um, they've been wasting a lot of time. I feel like um, they're very bored with their life. Okay. Yeah, and I feel like this is the divine. The divine's getting mad at this person. Get up out of this chair because they're under judgment here. Get up and go bring respect to Cancer's name. You know, you go be, uh, you show your respect, right? And do the right thing and ask for forgiveness. Spirit's getting mad at this person. I'm telling you. <laughs> Um, yeah. Yep, go, go make this right. Bring Cancer her justice or his justice, take it how it resonates, for, for hurting Cancer in the first place. You hurt this earth angel, now you need to bring them some respect. Yep. Um, they're giving this person their strength. They want them to be strong. They want them to, and this is the world that they're holding in the palm of their hand. So I feel like this is a cycle that's closing out, and this person is expected to, to close out the cycle properly. Okay? I don't want to call it karma. I just, it feels more like a daily punishment. Okay? Every day that goes by that they don't um, do the right thing and apologize to you, um, for everything that they did is a day that they get punished. They're feeling very panicky, Cancer. This person's having a lot of anxiety. Um, they're about to reach out to you, okay? They're all up in their emotions. I feel like they're exhausted. They're a wounded warrior. Um, there's so much destruction in their life right now. I mean, you know, look at this. This is what's going on in this person's life right now. Every day until they do the right thing by an earth angel. This is somebody who's in love with you. They've been hanging out in a safe zone, right? Trying to stay comfortable, you know, trying to hide. But um, spirit's not letting them do that. There's that tower moment right there, right outside their window. They're overwhelmed by everything in life right now. They, they can't keep it together. They're losing money. They can't pay their bills. Their house is a mess. Everything seems to be going crazy in their life. All right? And, and it's going to continue that way until they do right by an earth angel, guys. All right. So give me one more for cancer. And then you know what? I'm going to take this into the extended. Um, because this person is about to take action. They're about to come in and um, beg for your forgiveness, okay? Um, so I want to see how that goes, you guys. Yeah, see, they're, they're starting to get jealous, suspicious, feeling possessive cancer because you are about to meet somebody new. You're about to start dating again. There's new suitors that are coming towards you, um, that, oh, Cancer, they're very passionate about you, okay? Um, so, yeah. 
I feel like it's to the point where this person, um, they just can't take it anymore. They can't take the punishment anymore, and they can't take the jealousy and the worry about you getting snatched up by somebody else. So they're about to come forward and communicate. Let's go over to Patreon and see how this communication's going to go, okay? <laughs> Anyway, Cancer, my darlings, that's what I've got for this quick check-in. I do hope this helps. I hope it resonates with you. Like and subscribe to the channel if you like this vibe, right? Join this awesome soul tribe. Oh, wait, I have one more thing. I want to show you the decks that I'm giving away, right? Um, let's just put them on the table really quick. All right, Cancer. So, Christmas giveaway time, you guys. Um, I've got five decks here. Uh, all you have to do to enter to win one of these is be a subscriber and type in the comment section the name of the deck that you want to win on Christmas Day, okay? Um, we've got the Beginner's Tarot. This is great for if you're, you know, wanting to learn how to read tarot. We've got the Star Kissed Tarot deck. Okay, really awesome intuitive deck, you guys. I have this one. I love it. We've got the Lucky Journey Tarot. Okay, we've got another chance to win the Garbage Pail Kids deck, which I love. And we've got, of course, the Cat Tarot. This is what everybody wants to fight over during the giveaways, so I have to include this on every giveaway, you guys. So anyway, um, yeah, all you have to do is be a subscriber. Type in the name of the deck that you want to win, and on Christmas morning, I'm going to announce all the winners. Okay, so, yes. Anyway, my darlings, that's what I've got for today's reading. Like and subscribe to the channel, and until next time, everyone, take care of you, and peace out.